Do you work out ever? Do you like to look and feel good? But do you also drink alcohol? Today I'm gonna to share with you some tips on how to look good and feel good while still being able to drink alcohol because a lot of times people think, well, if I wanna have an excellent looking stomach, I gotta not drink alcohol. Well, that's true to a certain extent, but I'm gonna give you my story on how I was able to go from drinking all the time to drinking moderately and still be able to gain a great physique, but most importantly, be healthy. It's a pure fact that alcohol has empty calories. Listen, regardless if you drink beer, tequila, vodka, wine, the list goes on. These are pure sugars, that have absolutely empty calories and are not gonna do your body any good for the long run. Anything in moderation is absolutely fine. But for me, personally, in my 20s, I used to drink at least four or five times a week. And I'm not talking about one or two cocktails. I'm talking about six to seven and just feeling bloated, looking bloated and not happy. Mind you, I was working out all the time. I was actually working out more than I do now currently. Currently, I work out anywhere from three to five times a week, between 30 and 45 minutes, along with stretching and as well as yoga. A lot of times people ask me, Jason, how can I look and feel good and have a great physique while still drinking alcohol and not having to quit it? Unless you're a bodybuilder, a physique sculptor, or just a bikini competitor as a whole, there is no need to have to quit completely. I believe in life as a lifestyle coach, everything should be done in moderation. No one is saying stop drinking completely, but you have to do it in moderation. So let's take vodka, let's take tequila. You can have one or two shots a few times a week and still be able to look and feel amazing. Say you go out on a Saturday night and you don't have to wake up early. It's okay to have those one or two drinks. Ideally, you wanna have them with water or you wanna have them with soda water, tonic, just stuff that is not gonna bloat you and affect your physique. Now, anytime you go over the one, the two drinks, well, more than likely, you're just gonna be having munchies and then you're gonna get even more bloated and go back to the returning cycle of unhappiness. A lot of times people just mentally say, oh, well, I go to the gym a few times a week. I deserve to have these drinks. That was me. I was working out actually five to six times a week and I wasn't getting the look I desired. I was bloated. Yes, I was muscular. I was very, think of Jersey Shore, thick and bloated, just big all around. And it's just, it wasn't fun. And I needed to find something that worked. And I'm giving you advice that worked for me and thousands of my clients throughout the past few years that I've helped. No one is saying stop. All I'm saying is be more conscious of when and how often you drink while you can still enjoy life. Are you with me on this? I still love to have at least two or three times a week one or two drinks. Me personally, I drink girly drinks. What is that? Miller 64 or vodka with grapefruit. Very clean. Right when I'm feeling that slight buzz, then it connects. I'm saying, wow, I'm happy. I'm feeling good. I'm in a great atmosphere and I know when to stop. Mind you, when I was in my 20s, when I was in my 20s, I had to drink until I was drunk. And that to me was the definition of having a good time and drinking and saying, oh my God, I'm really tipsy. But guess what? I would wake up the next morning hungover, feeling like crap, and it's just not worth it. And believe me when I tell you, if you wanna look good and feel good 24 seven, if you drink in moderation and know when is your time to say, I gotta put the drink down, you're gonna be in control of this. And if you want more tips, all you have to do is hit subscribe and listen, most importantly, ask me questions. Whatever you're feeling stuck on, I'm here to help you. I'm here to serve you, baby. Hit me with a thumbs up. Share this with your friends and family that also like to drink and know that, hey, you know, the stomach, the, the, the gut doesn't have to be there. You can still drink everything in moderation. I'm here to help you. Make sure you subscribe to my website, jasonrosell.com. The link is on the description and I'll see you 
on the next one. Remember, you control your mind. Your mind doesn't control you.